Now, you, you mentioned uh, permitting issues uh, a bit earlier, and that's been a perennial complaint uh, for years. There was some movement, uh, I think, at one point last year. There was a, a brief right. glimmer of hope for improvement uh, that I think faded away. Uh, are you at all optimistic about anything changing uh, in that regard, say, in this calendar year, or is that inevitably something that gets pushed over to a new administration or the next administration? I am always an optimist. And on this, I am really optimistic. And the reason I am, David, is because Republicans and Democrats um, have both indicated or, or they have all indicated to me that they're very concerned about the permitting process. If you think about it, for, again, from the business perspective, where you want to put that shovel in the ground, but it's taking years for a permit to, to be able to do so, whether that's because of state um, reg, uh, state agencies or federal agencies. Um, and then you have, uh, uh, think about the clean energy investments that the administration is making right now. We, we simply can't get things built because of the lack of, of a streamlined permitting process. And then also think about if we're, if we're talking about our competition with China and China's ability to, to produce and mine critical minerals for many of those uh, uh, batteries and clean energy uh, technologies that, that we're trying to employ here in the United States, but our inability to do so here because it takes 15 years to get a mine permitted, 15 years from now, I, I'm sorry, but China will have the advantage. So we've got to figure out how to make sure that we are protecting safety, we're protecting uh, environmental standards, but moving the process along much more quickly. And I would say also uh, coordinating uh, the various agencies that have to sign off on permits, coordinating their work so that you have one, um, uh, you know, one timeline rather than say 10 timelines because you have 10 agencies that are part of the process.